Hey YouTube, it's Ross Ross Magas. Um, and this is not real life, and we are gonna be playing, as you can see, Resident Evil 3. Uh, I actually do want to say something real quick before we get started. Um, I actually did record the first part of this game. It was about half an hour of footage. I attempted to use a splitter from my PS4 controller to my Elgato HD and only got this mic's audio uh, and none of the game audio because the PlayStation has that annoying habit of turning everything off. Um, so I think we figured it out. Uh, if you know how to do that, uh, please leave a comment so I can see what you guys did to have that fixed. But if I'm not really talkative this time, it's because this is like the second or third time I'm playing this. And um, <laughs> let's just get started. Ooh, we got pictures. Uh, I wonder if I have any bonuses. Nope. I think if you pre-ordered the game, you could get costumes. Like, I think you get the classic costume. Um, maybe not the classic Resident Evil 3 costume. Or maybe it's in there. I have no idea. But I know you get the classic Star's shoulder pad costume. So this part is actually, I found it kind of weird. Um, it's kind of weird that they're just using found footage. I guess it's way cheaper. He was knocked out consciousness. I laughed at that last time. Uh, city wide emergency has been declared. The CDC has quarantined the lower Midwestern region of the U.S. Commitment, honesty, integrity, these are the Gorgeous. core values that create the foundation for Umbrella. It's this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. It is still weird that they chose to do like this live action CG combo. Codename Nemesis. In case y'all didn't know, there's the little beret. What? Unnerving combat. Mounted animals. Interesting. What a weird title for a book about horses. <laughs> I mean, I guess there could be other animals that are mounted animals, but horses is probably the likely candidate. Um, I read some of these. Jill had a report explaining that she's being monitored or something. Uh, Umbrella sucks. Yada yada yada. She's not crazy, but she's keeping track and Umbrella is suppressing all the news about the mansion incident in the Arclay Mountains. Can I open the fridge? Well, maybe not now. I can open it later though. Oh, so pay attention. I noticed this earlier. This is a Glock 19. Um, it says so in the game too. Uh, but actually, I'll point it out when it comes up. Just pay attention to that. That that's a Glock 19. Yeah. <laughs> 
God, that one your chest is so gross. <laughs> Oh, before I forget, if you if you want to find out real quick, if you have a, a phobia you'd never heard of, Google fear of holes. It's gross. I'm warning you. So, um, but you'll find out real quick if you got a, that fear or not. Fucking hell. Gets worse every night. Three more days, then I can kiss this town goodbye. Hmm. I remember. What's going on out there? Yep. Uh, anything over here? Nope. 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 I actually didn't check the last time if there was more hidden um, voiceovers. Uh, yeah, yeah. She just outlines how the virus is done. She thinks she's infected. That's probably why she's freaking out. Um, and she's concerned that maybe she has a long incubation period. Um, this one, it doesn't say who it is. Here's a note from Brad. Uh, I already read this, so I'm not reading it out loud again. If you were curious, the fridge does open. Nothing in it though. Hmm. This reminds me, I haven't played Resident Evil 7. God, your water must, your water bill must be so high. Leave the faucet on all the time. Yep, you're still hot, it's okay. Oh yeah, so if any of you are out there who are PlayStation users who record as well, know how to record um, using the headphones aspect on the PlayStation controller. Uh, just to make sure that we reduce the amount of feedback we get so I can hear what you guys hear. Um, leave a comment and let me know how you figured it out, how you fixed it. Uh, and I apologize if there is any feedback. Uh, I tested it out and it didn't seem like there was any, so... Um, or it was not. I couldn't tell. Hello? Jill, are, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. All right, let me grab my. Damn. I know I saw it, but still, like, she just ate it. There. See, she's got a, a different gun now. Boom! What the hell is that thing? Oh, I did check with my brother in between the last recording and this one. Apparently, people have been shit. <laughs> Making the joke that he looks like he's wearing a bunch of trash bags. Let's go, let's go, let's go! I think he said stars? Maybe he's just yelling. No way! Uh, both of those guys fall. Oh. Whoa! I wonder if at Umbrella Corps they teach you how to make an entrance. <laughs> I laughed the last time, last couple of times too. Because like he flings out this huge ass tentacle and then the camera's like right on Jill's ass. So don't be surprised when you find there's a ton of hentai about that. Damn. The 
It looked like it hurt. I mean, all of that looked like it hurt, but. Well, if you don't know, he actually waits a couple seconds here. Ooh, did I wait too long? I know, but right now it's got a hard on for the only two stars left in town, you and me. I'm not sticking around. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. <laughs> How did this all happen so fast? <laughs> I don't know. One fucked up thing always oh, leads to another. Oh, look at that. Light green. <laughs> it's like our play on steroids. Oh, so yeah, let me see if I can remember what I said. Uh, apparently this is a reference to Alien. Um, I guess somebody who worked on Alien worked on it. Hey, wait! Um, Down here! That's Val Kilmer, apparently, and Tom Cruise over there is a really old Capcom arcade shmup. Uh, I don't think the other things are anything. Aside from just being like references to movies. Uh, and apparently... Everyone misses this thing. I missed it the first couple of times playing it and my brother pointed it out to me that he missed it My other brother missed it and all the channels he's seen who play it missed it. So just so you guys don't We got you covered Brad, here they come. I wonder what he was doing hanging out near the, the fence Let's go! Oh. Yep. You see, you see. Take a look. Make that game, Capcom. I've been waiting years for that game. Yeah. That's a lot of blood. Don't think about it. We're gonna make a run for it. Come on, Jill. We know how this ends. No. I don't. Are we still a yes, team? Yes, do. Then do me a favor. Don't fuck up like I do. Go! Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, Brad. Sorry. And now, that's the gun that was on her bathroom counter. But we only have five bullets, so we'll worry about that now. Damn. You know, I, I already saw this and I'm still like flinching. <laughs> you didn't pay for your bus fare. You, down there, get to the parking garage roof. Parking garage. If Jill was a zombie, he'd be dead. <laughs> I'm not going out there. The parking garage oh. isn't far. I can. The only it. safe place is in here. Sir, what's your name? I can't just leave you behind. It's Dario Rosso. And yeah, right. You just want to steal my safe house. Get your own, Missy. Missy. I doubt it, but I think it'd be really cool if there was actually like, um, because you don't have to hear him say his name. If something different will happen later on, because you did listen to his name. Look, look, 
look, look. I'm your greatest fan! That one surprised me the first time, though. Messed up the first time. <laughs> I think she's so skinny. Come on. Jill must get thrown out a lot, thrown around a lot. Sorry. Wait for it. <laughs> Dang. Stuart, damn it. It's my turn, bitch. You tell him. Remember to wear your seatbelt, kids. Just showing off. Oh, there's only one in there. God, that's why he dumped it. Hey, easy, lady. I got you. Who are you? What are you doing? Name's Carlos. And I'm saving you. Come on, let's get you someplace safe. I think we're in the clear. Hope so. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Oh, come on. Who's the dipshit to close this? Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. Hey, what do you know about that thing. monster? Oh, they're people. This kind of looks like a demon watermelon. What? What? Look, this, this, okay, this, this is the most unrealistic thing right here. There is no way a movie theater is going to be giving you concessions for this cheap. seen anything like it but it's no zombie it knows what it wants yeah, and won't stop till it gets it don't you like that in a man no thanks he's all yours nope can't pass it listen I Guess promise you're in good hands nope I'm with the umbrella biohazard countermeasure service ubcs for short are you kidding me are you fucking kidding me you guys are the ones who caused all of this whoa 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 what are you talking about Look, you don't have to trust me but i'm going to the shelter you coming? Bam. 
Come on. It's this way. Oh, and if I remember, this is the only other thing I pointed out. Uh, I joked, this is Dr. Wily and this is Dr. Light, but apparently it's not a joke. And uh, there you go. So, Mega Man and Resident Evil, same universe, confirmed, in-game. Now we just need the next Mega Man game to have zombies in it. <laughs> Or the next Resident Evil to have Mega Man in it. This fine young lady could use our help. Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady her name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Victor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Hmm. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Most of the 100,000 civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. I'm in. <laughs> but I am on their side, not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Okay, first things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. Oh, and if y'all wanted to start with this gun right away, uh, he's not going to give us one because he's not cool like that. Uh, but if you play on easy, you'll get one. Nothing that I would miss. Oh, that was two gunpowders uh, for pistol ammo. And gunpowder, high grade, a shotgun, high grade, high grade is Magnum. There's a news article in the newsstand. It talks about. Um, Jill? It's me again. It. You topside yet? Working on it. So, what's the plan? The old tank's got me clearing the tracks. Might get the subway infrastructure back online. And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. I'll navigate you to the substation once you hit the main road. Copy that. Let's do this fast. Uh, the article was talking about what they thought were serial killer or like a just a bunch of grisly murders that they named the cannibal murders, and it was just because zombies outbreak had been happening, but not in full force, so people didn't know that it was happening yet. Uh, you can actually combine just by tapping square to select an item and then move it to the one you want to combine with. This also works for upgrades on weapons based on the last game. I hope I can't do that. Okay. Uh, okay. It almost looks like I could get this working if I plug in the right whatever it is. <laughs> cool. Oh, fuck. Whatever. Cool. And the funny thing is, like, I'm making 
way better time than the last time because I like stopped to talk and like in, not talk, but to like enjoy all the little surroundings and stuff. So this is basically all caught up now. Um, what's this? Oh, it's not a locker. Never mind. All right, so let's just keep it going, and I guess going on, going forward. <laughs> It's basically a blind playthrough. Um, if you've played the demo, you've probably seen this part. Can I do this? Oh, nope. Okay, that doesn't work that way. Oh, fuck. Yeah, pro gamer skills right here, yo. Screw you. Oh, okay. I think in the demo you had to press down up for that, but it looks like if you press back while you're stabbing, she does that little back step. Oh, in case you didn't know, look at the little thing. Uh, red means you haven't gotten everything in that area. Blue means there it's all done. It's real handy if you're trying to figure out if you've done everything or not. Oh. What the hell happened here? Jeez. Damn, a dollar a gallon? I've been trying to curse less as I have a son and I'm ah! Oh my god, am I gonna die now? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Knife is pretty weak. Hang on, I'm not done with you. Oh, it looks like they took out the oh wait, they did tell me that. They took out the ability to dismember them like in RE2. I guess it takes up too much information for the city and all that stuff. Are you alive too? I think in the demo, at this point, Nemesis would show up. No, not at this point. But Nemesis would show up in the demo. Oh, there's a chain. Okay. Ah, look at that. Classic Capcom. Classic, classic. Can I get one of these? <laughs> Buy one, get one 50% off. I think I've seen this kid before. What am I looking at in here? Oh, look, it's a little. Did I pass one of those? I think I saw one of those already. God. Damn it. Oh my god. I, and like I just said, I was trying to stop cursing because I have a kid. And I don't want to curse. Oh my. It's, it's hard. It's hard. Habits die hard, okay? It's not that I got anything against cursing, but like, you know, you always got to know when's the right time, right place. So, are there any kids out there watching this? Carlos, this is your parental lesson. Avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. Surely a tall drink of water like yourself can put out a few flames. <sighs> Fuck you. <laughs> and this game's got cursing anyway. Um. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm brave now. I got the wall. What you got? What? Oh, I can't even hit this. There you go. Haha. <laughs> what? Am I dying? I am. Kinda. Um. But yeah. So. Don't curse in front of your parents, kids. Like. 
just be polite. There's no need for it. But if you're just hanging out with your friends, go nuts. That's just that's, that's my take. No one's gonna be able to stop you anyway. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh, this fat boy's hungry. Fat boy wanted a Jill sandwich. Are you alive? I guess not. What? Oh, I hit the wrong one. Oh, this one's alive. There you go. Oh. What? It is dark. I can't see anything. If I remember, these guys don't move either. Yep. Is she run faster? That was nice that it rattled in there. We'll keep it going, we'll keep it going. Yeah. Oh, I almost missed it. Everyone else out there, if it, is it too dark? Is this your experience with this game as well? I think it's really dark. Okay, come on, come on. One, two, three. Oh, no, no. Oh, clever girl. What? Okay, I got to come Stab on this end. <laughs> oh. Damn, he just lost part of his face. I guess headshots do do more damage. Okay. There we go. Oh, okay, can't go there.
<laughs> Why God? Oh. No, stay under the car. I know you just mad because you ratchet. Oh! That's what I get for talking smack. Ooh, nope. Trying to be slick. No, I'm gonna stab you now. I keep pressing square to pick things up. Why is that? Okay. I wonder if your head really gets thrown back like that. You will... I don't have a problem. I swear I have no anger issues. I promise. I'm not stabbing them for... Because I have problems. <laughs> oh. Damn. I was not reading that. I didn't hear the name of the song. It sounded like date rape. Nine... Three seven. Okay, nine three seven. Physical fitness recovery. Oh, that is not what I thought that was. <laughs> okay. Oh, I thought I somebody. I thought I saw somebody. Let's go up here. Looks like this part is exactly the same as it was in the demo, and I think that is the same combination that I was in the demo as well. Damn, your face is ugly. Can you open the door? Oh, I guess you can. Oh, back up. Headshots. Okay. That's a hair tonic? I didn't even read what it does. I mean, it's a sight, so must help out. Oh, okay. I haven't gone through here. I might have to brighten the game. I can't even see what I'm doing. Back here. I should have kept that. Oh, uh, live and learn. Do -do 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 -do. How many zombies are there, I wonder? <laughs> ah! Oh, we're 
back here. The city looks pretty great. I mean, as great as a busted city can look. But... Oh, I didn't think it was that hard, Joe. Well, I guess you did run into it full force. Oh, where'd you come from? Here. Oh, that's right. Nope. Ah. Let's find out what's in here. What do they do with the little thing? Does it just go back? Oh, it does. Say something different? No. Nope. Uh, store. I don't have a shotgun, so we don't need that. Hmm. It's been... Maybe that's why I thought I saw the dude. Toy uncle. Where did I see it? Anyway. Oh. Jill's not very happy. We can't remember where the toys are. <laughs> oh, there's a dude right there. Hehe. <laughs> That was a waste of bullet. <laughs> Alright, well that is going to be part one. This seems like a great place to pause real quick. Actually, let's hit a save in case I die. Um, and yeah, I think, you know what? Actually, I'm just going to brighten it up a little bit. I don't know if it's where my room is or if there's too much light. Um, maybe that will help too if I turn the lights off. Uh, well, that's been Resident Evil 3 Part 1 again. <laughs> uh, I think this time we're good. And uh, I've been Ross Ross Magas. Hit that like, share, you know, notification bell. Y'all know the deal. Y'all geniuses. Um, nice geniuses who love helping out people. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in Part 2 next time.